Hello, Andy. So this is your Dyna pouch, and I'm just going to go over it so that you know how to use it. Um, basically, it's based on the tools that you sent me that you have, and I made it so that all of them would fit inside. So, if I open it up, I can release the snap here and snap it to the strap so it stays open like a tool apron. And then inside, oops, you can't pull too hard on that, I guess. Inside you have gas-powered soldering iron, clips, carabiners, hot glue, kind of long tools that can fit into these elastic straps. Um, we have a pouch here for kind of small bits and pieces, like safety pins, super glue, other things that you had on your list. Then inside this circle there's a strong magnet so you can easily clip more magnets onto that. Maybe I need to add another snap here so this doesn't come off by itself. Um, and then you have a pouch here. You can go inside and you can turn on an LED strip. And then when you close the pouch, you can kind of snap this back on itself and then the magnets are kind of hidden behind it. You can close it back up. And now the LED strip here is displaying the value of a sensor on the front here, you can sense nature with. And on the back of the strap there's two just exposed metal snaps. And if you wear this against your skin, you can use it as a galvanic skin response. So right now I'm not very excited, but if I touch it with my fingers, it changes to green. Um, on the front there's also another pouch, you can put more materials in. Um, there's also a little vibration motor packaged in a, in a similar to this. So this is a light sensor inside here with two snaps and two snaps on here. You can snap it on and on the back here you could also snap this vibration motor on. And if you reprogram the module on the inside you could program it to vibrate based on the sensor value. And you can remake more of these sensors for yourself. So just to show you inside. Basically you have a uh, addressable NeoPixel LED strip here. Um, and then you have two wires coming from those snaps and two wires coming from these snaps. And they're all kind of coming to the inside of the pouch. And I've kind of soldered some headers on them. And you have a little Arduino on a breadboard in a box, and you can reprogram that, and you have a battery supply here. So that's it. Oh no! The snap even came off the... I'll have to redo that. <laughs> made it so there's not too much going on on the outside so that when you're doing whatever you do in the jungle it doesn't get stuff doesn't fall out and you don't get caught on anything. There's a strap here adjustable you can cut it shorter if it's too long 